developed on the island of Newfoundland, this breed is a remarkable swimmer with a history of performing incredible water rescues. The specific ancestors of this breed remain unknown, although it may be related to the Pyrenean mountain dogs that accompanied fishermen in the area. In the 18th century, the Newfoundland was sent into Britain and France and quickly became popular with the English sailors as a ship dog. The breed became so renowned for its ability to perform water rescue that two Newfoundland dogs were a required part of the equipment on lifeguard stations along the coast of England. As a ship dog, the Newfoundland's job was to swim ashore with the line from the ship, establishing a connection with the help on shore. The Newfoundland was such a powerful swimmer that he could also haul a small boat to land. One Newfoundland ship dog is credited with diving off the deck of a boat in the dark and rescuing Napoleon Bonaparte after he had fallen into the water. The Newfoundland has a sweet disposition and is at home on land or in the water. The dog is an ideal companion for one person or a family, but the size of the Newfoundland should be taken into consideration. The adult Newfoundland does not require a great deal of exercise but can easily become a couch potato. He should be allowed daily walks, a run in the yard or especially a swim to keep fit. Extra weight can shorten the already short lifespan of a Newfoundland, usually 8 to 10 years. As with any large breed, a Newfoundland requires plenty of food during the first year of growth. They literally gain 100 pounds in the first year. After that, however, their metabolism slows down, and they do not require nearly so many daily calories. A lean Newfoundland is definitely healthier than one with extra weight. Newfoundlands are friendly dogs who love to keep you company. However, they do shed and are prone to drool on occasion. Grooming is important for this breed, both for their comfort and health. The coat needs to be brushed regularly to remove dead hairs, and nails should be kept to a short length. Regular nail trims will help to keep the feet from splaying, since they do have to support a heavy load. 